Good morning guys and welcome to today. Today is kind of crazy, but let's get going. Let's get up, get going, and see what today has to bring. It's raining you guys. It's pouring rain. The chiropractor comes today and it's a flood zone. Absolute flood zone. Oh so, yeah, it's raining. I hate to bring people to our farm when it's a disgusting mess outside. I feel so bad. I did message her and say, listen, you need to bring boots, but she already left. So I told her. I have boots she can borrow. Everybody's got breakfast. It's stinky in here. Hi, huh, Betty Ben. He's such a cute boy. Here you are. So handsome. Did you even didn't just shoot a video? It was your day to do the turnout challenge. Okay, well I can still turn them out. It's gonna be a fail since we're doing something new. Okay, I think that that's a good idea. Look. So, this is what we're rigging up, you guys. It's gonna be double wire. Yeah. It's gonna be double wire. All right, so basically we're doing the biggest mistake, probably, I don't know. I know we're gonna get a lot of grief from it. We get a lot of grief from everything we do, but basically, chiropractor's coming. We are not gonna feed our horses out here. It's like a flood zone. Like, it's not safe, slippery, and there's no way that the horses, oh, it's flooded over there too can in the backfield can get out of the rain. So just for the next couple of hours, because it's supposed to stop by 10, we're gonna try and, even if we have to sit here and make sure things go okay. So last night, mom and Gabby put all their foods in. Mom. Mom put all the food in the horse's stalls except for Stella's hay, so we did that. And then we let the horses in and we just realized that Willow had Stella's food, and Stella had Willow's food. And then Willow ate all of Stella's food in a bite. Ah, uh, like, even though it's color-coded, it's hard. It's so hard to remember everything. I guess but she loved that grass. <laughs> no wonder. But worse is that uh, they get the same grain, except for, sort of, that we're still using up Willow's old grain, so Stella probably loved Willow's grain. <laughs> Yeah. She's not eating her other grain. Yeah, because she wants only the good stuff, huh? This whole entire life? I mean, technically. Technically, Vinny can jump through that. Ugh, that has to happen Guys, Vinny's not that scared of electric fences. So, um, out there, I took the bottom one off. And then I was going to take the top one off. But I see this pretty valley to boy go so yeah, Finn will charge the fence if he thinks he can get through. All right, let's put hay out. All right, so yeah, this is unorthodox for sure. Carrying horses, carrying horse owners. Come on, let's put the hay out. Why are you showing her the butt, Finn? He's like, this is taking a lot longer than normal. Normally I'm out by now. Oh, here we go. All right, let's go, let's do it. Come on, grab your piles of... Hey, let's just take a second to appreciate the amazing gates, poles that Sam put up. Hopefully the horses don't see these standards and think jump and jump these because, yeah, yeah that could happen. All right, look at what I found today, you guys. Today's the first day where I acquire everything that's left on the ground. Oh, that's so these, these are all my brand new personal wow. possessions that people are going to have to work to get back. Oh, <laughs> what? Sophie, I told you a million times. Right, trying it out. You guys, this is just for a couple hours. Chiropractor's coming and we don't want her to have to deal with our soaking wet ponies either. So, there you go, boys. They're like, oh dear. We have some new things that we can work on for the next time it pours rain like this before our paddocks are finished. Uh-oh. Don't be stupid. Don't do anything dumb. <gasps> <laughs> I'm 
right. That was a meltdown. All right, Stella, take a walk. Dirty girl. So I gave them back their stuff today due to overwhelming distress, emotional trauma by one person. Be careful. I don't know, I'm nervous about this. We're basically gonna be here the whole entire day. We don't have any water in there for them yet. You know why it's been in dump? Why is it in dump? Okay, over there he was parked right, the hay was parked right in front of him. Uh oh, there's a race there. And then he went over to Storm's Hay to eat Storm's oh, Hay. All right, girls, let me get that rake that somebody left sitting right in your way. Leave them alone so they can settle. Come on, Gab, Sophie, get out of there because Willow thinks you're gonna try and catch her and she's gonna stand in the rain. Which, I don't mind them just standing in the rain, but it's when they're running, trying to run through that mud that it gets dicey. All right, we got two butts and two heads. So the issue here is that if we had a full herd, like if our herd was all integrated and they were together, then this would not be an issue because they'd have the whole thing and all four of them have been in here a lot of times and it's not been an issue. But it's the fact that they're not integrated and they can't be in here together that's the problem. And they can't because Willow acts really sassy and Storm, who would be good with her, gets so irritated by her. No, she's like, I'm the boss of you. And Storm's like, nah, uh, uh. Yeah. Like, as long as she behaved, he'd be fine, but she doesn't ever give up being the boss like a typical mini mindset all right let's do chores yesterday our trainer was here and obviously they're not impressed by very many things because they've already been there done that but one thing fiona was totally impressed with that we had were these little buckets i was showing her um a subscriber sent these to us a whole bunch of them and we use every single one every single bucket of grain and supplement and salt we have these little buckets in them they're cool like these are legitimately the coolest thing anyway she was like wow those are amazing I can't believe it like these are just perfect I remember being at her barn and always being really stuck to find the measuring scoop there was never a measuring scoop or you had one scoop for each one scoop to serve all the grain so uh, one only one person could scoop the grain so these are awesome. Thank you so much for sending these to us. We love them. We use them all the time. And since it's one and a half cups, I can just um, scoop one and one for Finn. No, it's not one and a half cups. It isn't? No, it's one and a little bit. All right, so we're trying to figure out a way to hang, have a spot out here that the girls can hang their halters and their lead ropes. Yeah, go ahead, just put it up. Yeah, just put it up high because I get nervous of the horses. All right, well, that'll work probably. So we're going to hook up some hooks there that the girls can hang up their halters because they always end up right here. And then A, I can't find them, or B, I'm worried that the horses are going to get in there and get them tangled around their legs, or C, they're, my kids are turning into slobs, or all of the above. Do not get them going. Get out of there. Gabby is the going getter, the getting goer. The crazy one in the bunch that can get all these horses galloping in a minute. Out, out, out until after they can go back outside. I keep saying that we have a lot of inconsistencies in the way we all do things, which is why we started this series on what we do each morning. And it's helped me learn that not everybody understands things. Like Sam, this little cup. How many cups are in this scoop? One and a half. Yeah, there's a huge spider on that wood. Oh, is there a where? <laughs> now step on it. Okay, Sophie, how many cups are in this I scoop? One and a little bit. One and a one half? And a half. One and a little bit. Gabby, how many cups are in this little scoop? One and like a quarter. Okay, so three of us, Sophie, Gabby, and me are on one page, and Sam is on the wrong page. One Sam. And a yeah, one in a little bit. So it's. Well, saved us some green. You starved our horses. <laughs> so listen, basically, just wait, Gabby. So basically, this is 300 milliliters, and, uh, and the next line down is 200 milliliters, and one cup is 250 milliliters. So it's between the Why top. Why did they do that? Why don't they just make it a cup? 
because this is in a different these, everybody. these came from a different country these came from Europe so they do things differently there all right so that is one example of how we don't feed our horses consistently because not everybody's on the same page all right so okay Okay, so whoa, 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 whoa. So we are getting Sophie's on feeding Stella today. And let's see. So Sophie thinks that that's four flakes. One, two and a little bit, because that's four. Okay, so they both think something different. So I'm going to show you what. I'm going to show you what I learned. If you take your arm from your hand to your... Well, not that way. You have to go the other direction. Right. So that's about how much... It goes here. So now... Your theory is wrong. Yeah, a full... So it's about almost what you guys... It's a fish. So that, that will do. So that will do. There's okay. another way you can tell. No, 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 no. You have to lift it all up together. Another way is that Stella's hay all fits neatly in that bucket. Okay, so watch. Stella's hay should all fit nicely <laughs> in her bucket. <laughs> Stella's if you imagine watching. that, that'll be in 10 pounds, nine and a half pounds probably. Guys, Stella's watching. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, how much hay are you giving me? I just wanted everybody to see Gabby how much has to go in there. Hi, pretty girl. Hello. So I was like, how much are you giving me? You better give me a bail. <laughs> She's just happy not to be out in the rain. So the rain is stopping. The water is still there, but not as flood-like as it was before. So hopefully we'll be able to release these horses very, very soon. Right, I've been down here for hours. Horses are almost done their breakfast. I'm tempted to give them a little bit more. Uh, to keep them calm until after the chiropractor comes, but they're so calm and Gabby is so right if you guys didn't see So if we put a video up on her channel uh, Guess the horse challenge and Gabby said that her horse is the softest fur and oh my gosh he does Our farrier thought we shaved him because he's so clipped, but um, Everybody's calm and happy. Are you happy? They love that they can be right there at the door even though they're stuck inside I just thought that this is better than keeping them in their stalls because it might have come to that because their fields were so, such a huge mess. Like getting to the boys' field was a big, huge, I didn't want anybody to pull anything. And I didn't want the boys all messy and gross. Uh-oh. Storm. I'm going to go back up to the house, have some breakfast, and come back down about a half an hour, about a half an hour before the chiropractor arrives and uh, get the horses groomed. So she's just seeing two horses today. She's seeing Finn and Storm. Pretty, pretty, pretty girl. She's like, do not give me the hand unless you've got a treat, but no treats. All right, so chiropractor done. Finished. Horses are out. Ugh, let's put some horse. You know, some. The problem is, I don't like Finn and Storm too close together because Storm does that. Why do you put the hay together? Then? Well, I have my hands full. Come here, come here, Finny Finn. Come here, over here, buddy. What a disaster of a field! Disgusting. Okay, oh we God. are out shopping. We're shopping for the weekend because we're having special guests. Guys. And that is our special guest. So basically, there's a reason Kaylee is sleeping over. Get Kaylee, what's the reason? We Do are it. Doing... <laughs> I'm going to be handcuffed to Gabby for 24 hours. Hey. No riding for 24 hours. <laughs> what race? Starts now. What? Wait, now? Go, you should wash your hands. Is that, is that tight enough? <laughs> yeah. No. How are you guys gonna get your coats off? <laughs> no! <laughs> no! No, 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 no! No, I'm. Gabby, you're so scared. 
fucking handcuffs just for the next <laughs> Help, I can't get my coat up. Without hurting my hands. There will be no tooting for the next 20 minutes. I do not toot, so. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, can you say that again? Kaylee, you are cute. I don't know, let's just go into the store. The 24 hour challenge starts now. Look, I heard. Oh my god. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.